Hello everybody! Welcome back! I'm going to cook you some salmon fried rice. I have left some rice overnight from my fridge and I have two slices of fresh salmon. I have eggs. I have a bit of garlic, just one clove, just a batch. So you, if you don't like it, you can always take it out. And I got a bit of spring onion. So we shall rock and roll. What you might think about it? Rock and roll. Let me cut my salmon off the skin. Just slide it out. And you can see it's off. Turn it over, get the last piece out. And the last piece out. You can see there's no more skin. As that's it. If you get a skinless piece of fish, it's delicious. If you want if you like the skin, you got to take out the skill of it. Oh 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 don't jump out, we need you. So we take put this away. Then let me wash my hand quickly. I can smell the aroma of salmon. We ladies like to have beautiful clean hands, especially when you touch the food. Even the garlic. You might think, oh. I can smell garlic. I must wear a pair of gloves. No need to. That's it. Done. What you like. And get this onion. You must always remember, can, can can be always washed. But mouth, if you say the wrong thing, you can't wash it away, dear. It will always stick in your mouth, what you say. So, this is what I done. Oh, you nearly leave my board. Yeah. So you put everything near together. All right. Let's start. Heat up our wok. Always remember, Put the garlic in first, okay? Just toss the garlic. So some people don't like the garlic to be too strong. So what you do, you put it in and let it get heated up. So it's like almost cooked. So it doesn't smell. Yeah, leave it there. The wok is hot now. Turn it low. Turn the garlic over. Yeah, garlic is over. You can see the smell of it. Wow, put a bit of oil. Just a little bit of oil. You don't need to use too much oil. I don't like rice that float all over with oil. Go this way. You fry in the fish first. Don't forget the fish is coming back to the wok again. To a, from the wok to the bowl again. Yes. Because you don't want to put all the rice inside with the fish. And then you get the uh, smashy mash all the time you don't. Okay? It doesn't stick to your wall. Look at that, how beautiful. Okay, you, when your wok is on the right temperature, your fish do not stick. And it always comes to the right piece. You want it cold, you don't want it dry. You don't want it overcooked and get it so dry. And you want it taste nice, 
so you've got to cook it right. Be patient. Don't get frightened about the fish. The fish is dead. Don't get frightened about the rice. The rice is cooked. All you've got to do is to really, the theory is to toss it back hot. Put a bit of fish sauce on it. Just only a sprinkle. You don't want it too much. Put it back. Leave the garlic in and press the garlic. Then you get the second one. Leave the, the, the skin in, you can always take it out. The thing is, press the second one. Turn it low. Don't leave your fire high when you put the rice in or else you get burned. Just get it low. Keep frying it. Now you can press it. You can press it this way. Turn it over as you press it. You turn it over so it doesn't burn your rice. Doesn't sound nice, it goes thick and thick and thick. You can see. See, the rice doesn't stick on the frying pan. You can turn the higher a bit. And then, when you want to stir it in, you turn the fire low. You want to get the steam up. You know? then you fry. And then you won't think that you know, you know that your rice won't, won't burn. And you can see. the temperature of your of your cooker so that you won't say that oh Nancy didn't tell me I will burn my rice Nancy is not there to hold your hands so you have to use your brain okay yeah. so you slowly get the heat goes up then it goes slowly see let the heat go go through it Eggs is very important to cook it well done when you do your fried rice because you don't know how you can buy the eggs. They can, might say it's organic, it's, it's this morning. The chicken might not, the, I took it out. The garlic skin, okay? you can do is you can put some fish sauce okay. use your own common sense you're all adult to cook and then if you want a bit of color put a bit of maggie sauce on it a bit just a dodge then you get a nice colour. Okay. 
If you spill a little bit on your cooker, doesn't mean that you're not a good cook. Everybody spills some rice onto the cooker. Unless they're so fussy, they go like that, like that, like that, then they wouldn't lose anything. Good batter. Mmm, good batter. A little bit of the chili sauce. Just a little bit. Yes. And if you want more, you can add more. If you want less, you can add less. If you don't want to put any, don't put it. It looks nice. It really looks nice. So, you turn it high now, and that is so hot, so hot that you say, mm, I like that. Fried rice, you don't need to taste, just use automatically, and um, you just put some sauce on the table, put some chili sauce on the table, if they want, they can put more chili sauce. If they don't want, then leave it like that. Now I'm going to put my spring onion in. And then I turn it off. and build it up. This is two bowls of small bowl of rice. this fish on top, yeah, and push this on one side, sprinkle a little bit of onion because you did use onions to cook, and nice. Put it on the side. Some people are real scared of coriander. This is what I cook for you today. Salmon fried rice. Taste it. You like it? Give a thumb up. 